Hey, what's going on guys? Um, haven't made a video in a long, long time. Just thought I'd make one now, just recently with everything that's going on in Israel and Palestine and and all the hatred that's being spoken on, on both sides. And um, and I, I don't want to talk about the the geopolitics in it. Um, there's some people that, that can do a way better job than me and they can break down the history for you guys better than I can. What I would like to talk as a Christian, speaking to other Christians, is that how our responses as, as believers, you know. And um, I, I, I would keep in mind that, that we have many brothers and sisters that live in Palestine. And, and I know some people are going to think, oh, this is pro-Palestine, or oh, no, this is pro-Israel. No, this is just pro-love, pro-Jesus. Pro and um, so I've heard a lot of, of Christians say some horrible things. And, of course, I've heard Muslims say horrible things, and I've heard Jewish people say horrible things, too. So just, let's just people say horrible things, you know. Um, anyways, how we respond to those that hate us. I'm reminded of uh, the teachings of Christ, and Jesus is always reminding us to um, turn the other cheek, to love. And I'm not saying um, you can't respond um, militarily to something that's wrong, but how do we respond as believers? Not, not We're not the government, right? We're Christians walking in faith. So our job and our responsibility as Christians is to love everyone, even our enemy, right? And um, I, I just, I, I guess it comes, because I, I've seen horrible things, like I said, on both sides, but I, I saw some pastor or some leader say something about, oh yeah, let's just blow up the Dome of the Rock and build the the uh, the temple, and, and just it shocked me, and I was like, what? You know, just hatred, so much hatred that can flow from people. You know, it just, it, my, I mean, I don't take, I don't want to belittle this by using a, a sci-fi reference, but it just reminds me of when Yoda said, you know, um, you know, that, uh, you know, hate brings suffering. And it does. Hate, hatred brings so much suffering. And, and we as believers need to love one another and we need to love Muslims and we need to love Jews and, and pagans and, and non-believers and atheists and, and we need to speak out in love and, and during this time and, uh, and, and just to show our compassion for both sides because it is a very difficult situation considering we're not in Israel.